Do you run a venue where you wanna sell concessions using the event organizer app by SimpleTix? So this will allow you to sell tickets and sell drinks and t-shirts and cake all in one order. So you're not doing two separate orders. You know, in the past with SimpleTix, you'd sell your tickets using event organizer app and then you have to jump onto a different iPad and sell the merchandise from Square as a separate transaction. Well now with SimpleTix, with one transaction, you can do everything. Let me show you how it works. So there's two parts I'm gonna show you right now. The first part is inside of Square, and the second part will be inside of the SimpleTix Manager panel. So inside of Square, if you haven't created a category yet, um, so I've already created a category called Lunch Menu here, and I put the items in it, but if you haven't created a category yet, you can go ahead and do that now. So a category would be something like, like apparel, or t-shirts, or food items. Um, so I'll call it like, you know, like dinner, um, dinner menu, for example, if I wanted to create um, a dinner menu with items inside of it. That's the very first step. The next step is go to go over to item library and create different items. So what I've done already is I've created um, some simple items and some complex items. So what's a simple item? A simple item is something like, um, I have a chicken sandwich here. So for the simple item, it's really just one um, title and one price. So it's just chicken sandwich at $12.55. Now, a complex item would be something like these cakes I made, um, where I have cake as the parent title, and I have four variations, um, sponge cake, angel food cake, carrot cake. Um, there's different prices for each variation, so that's more of a complex item. So you can do items in two different ways. Um, for example, if you wanna do shirts, I would not recommend making an item called red shirt and another item called blue shirt. Instead, I would create um, an item called shirts, and then below it create, create a variation called medium blue, large blue, small red, large red, medium red. Like those would be different variations with different prices. Um, that's the best way of doing that. All right, so that's part one. And also um, when you create your items, make sure you set the category. So lunch menu is what we're going for here. So we've created about four, uh, three or four items here, and we put them all in the lunch menu area, category. Um, so I'll click close on this. Now let's jump into SimpleTix. So there's two ways you can sell um, your Square merchandise and Square catalog items in SimpleTix. Um, so one way is online. So if people buy tickets online for an event, let's say it's a football game, a like homecoming game, and you wanna sell that one um, homecoming you know, sweatshirt. So when they go to the checkout, they'll have an option to add it on. That's one way of doing it. In today's video, we're not gonna show you that. We're gonna show you the more simple way where you're not selling any of the Square Catalog items online, you're only share selling them on site. So for example, a movie theater, no one's really gonna buy their popcorn with their movie tickets ahead of time. They're gonna show up day of to do that, right? So um, what you're gonna wanna do is create one event in SimpleTix, I'm calling it Lunch at the Zoo, and make it a private event so it's not listed at all on your website. The next step is going over to Suggested Square Items, and we're gonna add those items that we created in Square to this event. So I'll click Add Item here, and I'm gonna choose that cake, I'm gonna choose that lemonade, I will choose the grilled chicken sandwich, and that's basically it. Yeah, those are the three items I made. I'll click Save Item here, and there we go. Now, if you want to change the sort order, you know, put the, the chicken sandwich on top, I can just simply drag and drop it like this. And I'll put the cake on the very bottom. I can do that too. That just affects, you know, how it'll appear um, on the event organizer app, as well as the web checkout, if you were gonna sell this on the um, web checkout. And that's basically it. So um, now, if I'm in the event organizer app, this is, you know, the next part of our show, um, if you go to the products tab, so basically you have your events over here, you'll have products over here, and these are the products that, you, that you're gonna sell. Um, now, if you want to sell tickets with products, that's our main goal here. If you go to upcoming events, let's say you're gonna sell daily tours for your zoo. So I'll click on tickets here, and I'll get two adult tickets. I will click add to cart. Now I'll click the back button over here. Now I'll click on products. And let's say you wanted to get that grilled chicken sandwich. Um, so I'll get one of those, click add to cart. You wanna get two lemonades, I'll click two over here, add to cart. And I'll go to cake here, 
And this is the one that had variations, right? So below it, you see the sponge cake at one price, the carrot cake at another price, and you click add to cart there. And now I'm gonna go to checkout. This is pretty big deal at SimpleTix. So at, in the past, we've only been able to sell tickets, but now we can sell square catalog items. So you can put t-shirts in here, anything you want, really apparel. Um, so here we have our daily tours as a ticket item. Below, we have these other items, you know, um, lunch options. And you can just do one order, do a payment, and check out. So hopefully you found this video helpful. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to email us, support at simpletix.com. If you have any comments or suggestions on ways we could improve this, uh, leave a comment down below in the description. All right, thanks a lot and have a great day.